Hello and welcome. So in this video, I'm going to talk about how to follow up your prospects in business. So um, in any kind of business, if you don't follow up clients, okay, you lose business, okay, you won't get really more sales. And um, it is proven with business people that um, the people that know you can actually buy from you much easier than actually prospecting to a new person and staying in touch with clients and um and your prospects is very, very, very ideal. But my biggest question is, how do you stay in touch with clients, okay? How do you stay in touch with your customers and the people that are really, uh, that you've actually spoken to, you know? I've actually had that huge challenge, you know, when, when I speak to someone in business and then I, I continuously try and find people to, 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 to by what I'm actually selling and all that. But I have realized that I'd, I've come across a lot of people that if I would have kept in touch with them, they would be giving me more business and more business. So if you're a business owner, you do anything online, network marketing, anything, anything that just sells anything, you want something that actually follows up on your people. And I'm actually going to uh, show you that right I'm actually going to show you something that I've actually got my hands on, which actually is an unfair advantage that can actually help you on that. So let me just um, share my, move on to my mobile a little bit, okay? And then I'm going to actually uh, start sharing my, I'm actually going to start sharing my screen. Okay, right now you're actually looking at the screen on my mobile, okay? And if I move over here, I slide again, there's this application that is called Cove, okay? And um, now, what I'm gonna do is, I'm actually gonna, okay, let me just continue sharing again, okay? What I'm gonna do is, I'm actually gonna open up, I'm actually gonna open up the application and this is what it looks like, okay? So it's more like a contact manager, okay? It's like, like a contact manager, okay? So what it does is yesterday I had a meeting with someone in, in Harare, okay? So, you know, they gave me a business card and all that. So what I'm gonna do is, you see on the top right corner, it says add scan, okay? So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna click on that. I need to add a new contact and then I'm actually gonna scan a business card. This is actually the business card that I got from the prospect or the client, okay? And then I'm gonna go ahead and da -da, and scan. Okay. Now it's scanning. Now as you can see that it has scanned the details that are actually on the <laughs> business card. So what I'm gonna do here is um uh it may not be able if it's the business card is not really clear, it's it's not gonna capture everything. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm actually going to move over and look at that's the name and then job title i'm actually going to change the job title here and i'm going to go and say business business developer okay that person is a business developer i'm just going to hit save okay and then i'm not going to send my business card for now and then uh okay let me just search for the person again that was i was not done with the okay business developer and then, um, so I'm actually going to edit the, the, the email address. I'm going to check if the email address was captured correctly. And yeah, the email address was captured correctly. And I'm actually going to check the phone number as well. So I'm actually going to edit the phone number again. Okay, let me just hit and add it. I'm actually going to edit a phone number. I'm supposed to do uh, plus 263. And then this is their landline. Okay, so I'm just going to see. And then I'm gonna change that to work, okay? And then now I'm actually gonna, I'm actually gonna um, come back here and then say notes, okay? I'm actually gonna add some notes, okay? Now I met this person about um, promoting, promoting their brand, okay? They agreed to our proposal. They agreed to our pro proposal, okay, and said we should meet on Friday, 
okay to finalize to finalize and then i hit save and then now i've actually added some notes now if i want to stay in touch with this person if i want to stay in touch with this person let me just move this here right at the top if i want to stay in touch with this person as you can see uh, there's this button that says in touch okay now it actually gives me this option that i want to stay in touch with this person monthly quarterly or yearly or never so i'm actually going to hit monthly okay because i want to check out on what the business is doing and and all that so if i need to send it if i need to call i can actually click on call okay if i need to let me just see if i need to call i can actually click on call if i need to text i can actually click on text if i need to uh you know if i need to keep the communications if i need to add a reminder i can actually add a reminder there so let me just head over okay let me just open up my my, my screen okay and then open this up and then if i need to add a reminder let me just add a reminder i need to add a reminder uh enter date i'm supposed to meet this person tomorrow okay that's tomorrow i'm gonna say tomorrow and uh 25 january no, the meeting is at tomorrow yeah the meeting is at 12 and then add a note uh to finalize the um proposal that i gave them and then i'm just going to add add a new reminder i'm supposed to meet these people and then the uh, reminder is actually added as you can see that the reminder has been added now if i need to communicate with this person okay let me just communicate uh with this person okay uh i'm going to say i'm going to hit that and then i'm just going to go like if i need to send an email if i need to send a text okay i need to send a text okay let me just go on the text and then i'm going to go like um hello it's good i here thanks very much for the meeting we had yesterday um looking forward to see you tomorrow have a great day then i hit send okay now once i hit send i'm gonna hit back i'm gonna hit back okay now the message has been sent i'm gonna hit back now it's gonna ask me the application is gonna ask me what message did you send so i have send a thank you message for the meeting and reminded them for the tomorrow's meeting okay and then i'm gonna go like add not okay so as you can see now on the application i have the communication which is the note that i've actually added and i've actually added the how often i want to just check on them okay now i've added a reminder for them for the for the meeting okay so i can actually add to favorites as well now again what i need to do now is um i need to go back and show you what this application does okay let me just go back there okay and let me just cancel the search now i have this application and what it does is it automatically finds the people that are actually in my uh contact okay and then they're going to tell you where they are in the world as you can see that this person is in south africa south africa and uh someone is in germany and um all this contact someone is in zimbabwe and then uh and all that so what i can do is um what i can what else can i do here I can actually go into improve if i need to go into improve so it's actually gonna say country information if someone moves to a new location it gives me that okay if someone is there if they change like their 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 phone number if they change their profession from what to what and then i'm just gonna click on there and then i'm just gonna go and update contact and then um i hit with code and then i'm gonna go like yes okay right not what i read that now let me just go back oh okay i'll just say done okay and then here you can actually um invite leads okay the people that you're actually prospecting you can actually 
invite them here. And now the coolest thing as well is if I go to my name right here, if I go to my name, I'm using a pro account. This is a pro account. Okay, I'm gonna show you where you can actually get this application. No, I can, now I can actually say, send a business card, okay? So this business card basically is, um, I need to add my email address there. It's something that you can send to an email, okay? Telling them a uh, business about what your business is all about and your profile and all that. So you just go to profile. Once you go to profile, you add your websites. And as you can see, the number of contacts that are right here, okay? These are like 2,165 contacts. And yeah, so um, let me see what I need to do. I just need to pause, close this. Okay, now let me just leave it like that. Okay, okay, let me just leave it like that. I'm gonna open up again. I'm gonna open up again. Let me just go there and then, now what's here? Then I go to my, okay, let me just go on this person. Okay, what was in name? So, okay, there was, what was in name again? Okay, so what this does is, let me see if I can, if I open up this contact, okay, what it does, it fetches like um, the email for the contact and it also fetches some social media contacts like their Facebook, their Twitter, and then they can actually, I'm actually given, I'm actually given that. So right now, let me just, uh, let me just go back to the contacts and actually search for someone, okay, that I contacted a few days ago. So if you look at this person, okay, this is what their profile is actually saying. It's actually saying that location, this person is in Germany, they work at BP Shell, okay, and then uh, this is their phone number, and that is their social media profile. So if I click on this, it's gonna take me right to their Facebook. As you can see, that I've actually set my contact to contact this person quarterly, okay? And as you can see right there, I've actually contacted them once. I can send them an email, I can send them a text, I can actually call them, and I can actually add a reminder right there, and I can actually choose to add them to the, to the, um, to the favorite and also it actually puts their profile picture there automatically so let me just let me just close this okay let me just close this and um this is kind of uh, a cool a cool so a, a cool application to use okay so right there if i can click on cancel so as you can see these are all my contacts these are all my contacts and it pulls information so that I can actually get in touch with uh, with um, with this contact. Let me just search for my friend there. Okay, so you can use this for for friends, for 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 friends, for relatives, and all that. So I'm gonna go like these are the communications, and I wanna keep in touch with this person monthly. He's my friend, and um, I can actually send him a message. Hey, boss, how are you? And then I'm gonna go like back and I can actually add a note and just checked in with, uh, with Clement. Okay, and then I'm just gonna hit add note. And then yeah, that, that, that's basically how this application works. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you like, um, so if you wanna stay in touch with your business people, this is one thing that you should have. And then here I can actually add tags, okay? You know what tags are? Now I can actually add a tag like a client, this is a colleague, this is a friend, prospect. So I actually did uh, a seminar, a social media management seminar recently, and these are some of the attendees. So let me just check for social media management, okay? So, um. I can go back here. Yeah? So like this person, uh, if I can click on that, as you can see, a tag, this tag was added so that they, uh, they stay in the social media management. I know that this guy, this person registered for my, to attend my social media 
management seminar. So I can actually want to keep in touch with this person once a month because I'm doing seminars once a month as well. I have their email address, I have their contact. And yeah, so let me just um, head over to, um, to the website a bit, okay? And show you uh, like what, what the pricing is like and I can show you how where you can actually get this price, this, um, this application for, for way less than they charge on the website. So as you can see, this is actually the website, it's actually an application. And you can actually have um, a web application. And then if I click on pricing, as you can see that you can have this application for free and I'm using the pro account, which is, which is 20, uh, which is 40, which is $40, okay, which is $4.99 per month, okay? So the difference that you get more when you have the pro, this is what I'm actually using. I'm actually doing this video on the 24th of, um, of January, okay? Now, if you want this application, if you get in touch with me within the next seven days, I'll tell you a place where you can get this application for $29, okay, $29 once off, okay? It's just a once off price that you actually pay and you don't pay these monthly fees. So what does your business mean if you stay in touch with, the client that you actually serve and the prospect that you have actually contacted. And you know, when you meet someone, you always scan their business card and making sure that you add their information into your application and everything is saved online. For a just one time payment of $29, I guess that's a giveaway price. So inbox me and I'll tell you where you can actually get this application at this price. So it's only available from the time that I'm actually doing this video and for the next seven days, it's just, Today is 29 January and I look forward to talking to you soon. Bye for now.